Unleash the power of Kali Linux on your Android device. Imagine having the capabilities of a full-fledged penetration testing environment right in your pocket. With Kali Linux on your Android device, you can carry out security assessments, network analysis, and ethical hacking tasks wherever you go. Welcome, ethical hackers and penetration testers. Whether you're a seasoned professional or just starting your journey in cybersecurity, this guide is tailored for you. Today, we're diving into the world of mobile penetration testing. Mobile devices are ubiquitous, and having the power of Kali Linux on your Android phone opens up a world of possibilities for on-the-go security testing. We'll install Kali Linux on your Android device. No need to root. That's right, you can keep your device's warranty intact while still gaining access to powerful tools like Metasploit, Nmap, and Wireshark. This guide is perfect if you are new to this. We will walk you through each step, ensuring you understand the process and can follow along without any issues. This guide provides a step-by-step -step approach to installing Kali NetHunter. From downloading the necessary files to configuring your device, we've got you covered. This process doesn't require you to alter your device's operating system fundamentally. You can still use your phone for everyday tasks while having a powerful penetration testing environment at your fingertips. By the end, you'll possess a formidable toolset for on-the-go ethical hacking. Imagine being able to test the security of a network while sitting in a coffee shop or on a train. Let's transform your Android device into a portable penetration testing powerhouse. With Kaylee Linux on your phone, you'll be ready to tackle any security challenge that comes your way. So let's get started and unleash the full potential of your Android device. Preparing your Android device for the journey. Before we begin, ensure you have the following, Termux app. Termux provides a Linux-like environment on your Android device. Download and install it from the Google Play Store. Internet connection. A stable internet connection is crucial for downloading the necessary files. Connect your Android device to a reliable Wi-Fi network. With these prerequisites met, you're ready to embark on this exciting journey. Updating Termux, the first step. We'll start by ensuring your Termux environment is current. This step is essential for compatibility and to avoid potential conflicts during installation. Open the Termux app on your Android device. Type the following command and press Enter Apt Update. This command updates the package lists on your Termux installation. It retrieves information about the latest versions of available packages. Termux will connect to its repositories and check for updates. Once done, you're ready for the next step. Acquiring Wagit, your downloading ally. Our next task is installing Wagit. This tool will download the Kali NetHunter installer. Think of Wagit as a reliable messenger, fetching the files we need. In your Termux terminal, type the following command and press Enter Apt Install Wagit. Termux will prompt you to confirm the installation. Type Y and press Enter to proceed. Wagit will be downloaded and installed on your Termux environment, adding a powerful tool to your arsenal. Obtaining the Kali NetHunter installer. With Wuget at our disposal, let's download the Kali NetHunter installer. This is an essential step in transforming your Android device into a powerful penetration testing tool. The process is straightforward, but attention to detail is crucial. This file is the key to transforming your Android device. It contains all the necessary components to install Kali NetHunter, a mobile penetration testing platform for Android devices. In your Termux terminal, type the following command, replacing version with the latest version number from the official Kali NetHunter website, and press Enter. This step is critical as it ensures you are downloading the most up-to-date version of the installer. Bash will get o install NetHunter Termux HTTPS slash ops EC slash NetHunter Termux slash install NetHunter Termux. This command instructs Wuget to download the specified version of the Kali NetHunter installer and save it as install NetHunter Termux in your current directory. Uget is a powerful utility that retrieves files from the web, making it perfect for this task. Ensure that the downloaded file's integrity is intact. This step is crucial to avoid any corrupted files that could cause issues during installation. You can verify the checksum provided on the Kali NetHunter website. This involves comparing the checksum of the downloaded file with the one listed on the website. If they match, your file is intact and ready for installation. If not, you may need to download the file again to ensure its integrity. To find the checksum, navigate to the Kali NetHunter website and locate the checksum value for the version you downloaded. This value is usually listed alongside the download link. 
In your Termux terminal, you can use the following command to verify the checksum. Replace with the name of your downloaded file, SHA-256-SUM. The terminal will output a string of characters. Compare this string with the checksum value from the website. If they match, your file is verified and you can proceed with the installation. If not, re-download the file and verify again. With the file verified, you are now ready to proceed with the installation of Kali NetHunter. This powerful tool will transform your Android device into a versatile penetration testing platform, opening up a world of possibilities for security testing and ethical hacking. Granting execution permissions to the installer. Before running the Kali NetHunter installer, we need to grant it execution permissions. This step allows your Android device to recognize and run the installer script. In your Termux terminal, type the following command and press Enter bash command plus x install NetHunter Termux. This command modifies the permissions of the install NetHunter Termux file, making it executable. You have successfully granted the necessary permissions for the installation to proceed. Now comes the exciting part, running the Kali NetHunter installer. This script will guide you through the installation process. First, in your Termux terminal, execute the following command. The installer will present you with a series of prompts. Carefully read and follow the instructions. The installation process may take some time depending on your internet speed and device performance. Be patient and let the installer do its magic. Congratulations! You've successfully installed Kali NetHunter on your Android device. This is a significant milestone and it opens up a world of possibilities for you. Now, let's take it a step further and access its powerful tools through a graphical interface. This will make your experience more intuitive and visually engaging. First, we need to set up a VNC server. Kali NetHunter conveniently includes a VNC server so you don't need to install anything extra. Open Termux on your Android device and configure the VNC server to allow remote connections. This involves setting a password and choosing a display number. Make sure to note these details as you'll need them later. Next, on another device, such as your laptop or desktop computer, download and install the NetHunter CAX Manager. This tool is essential for establishing a connection to your Kali NetHunter instance. The installation process is straightforward, and you can find the download link on the official Kali NetHunter website. Once installed, launch the NetHunter CAX Manager. Now it's time to connect to your Kali NetHunter VNC server. In the NetHunter CAX Manager, enter the IP address of your Android device. You can find this IP address in the network settings of your Android device. Also, enter the port number that you configured earlier. Double-check these details to ensure accuracy. After entering the IP address and port, click on the Connect button. If everything is set up correctly, you should now see the familiar Kali Linux desktop environment on your connected device. This graphical interface allows you to navigate through Kali NetHunter's tools with ease, making your tasks more efficient and enjoyable. With the graphical interface, you can now fully explore the capabilities of Kali NetHunter. Whether you're conducting penetration tests, analyzing network traffic, or exploring cybersecurity tools, the graphical interface provides a user-friendly way to interact with the powerful features of Kali NetHunter. Enjoy your journey into the world of advanced cybersecurity. Encountering issues during the installation process? Don't worry, here are some troubleshooting tips. First, verify your internet connection. A stable internet connection is crucial, so ensure your device is connected to a reliable Wi-Fi network. Next, double-check all commands for any typos or errors. Even a small mistake can cause issues. Also, ensure sufficient storage space on your Android device. The Kali NetHunter installation requires a considerable amount of storage. Finally, if you encounter persistent problems, refer to the official Kali NetHunter documentation for detailed instructions and troubleshooting steps. By following these steps, you've successfully installed Kali Linux on your Android device without the need for rooting. You now have a portable penetration testing platform at your fingertips. Remember always to use these tools ethically and responsibly. Happy hacking! If you found this guide helpful, be sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell for more exciting tutorials and tips on ethical hacking and cybersecurity.